Hey everybody, it's Beth. Today I'm taking this set of wooden dice from Dollar Tree and I'm painting them with sheepskin colored chalk paint by Folk Art. I gave them two coats. Once they were dry, I took black acrylic paint and drew on eyes, just kind of a curved line downward, and then took barely pink chalk paint, also by Folk Art, drew an upside down rounded triangle, and then the black acrylic paint again, a line down from the nose, and then two curved lines going upward. And then just some little whiskers. I'm just using a really thin brush for the black, just to make sure it's the lines are nice and small. And then on the next one, I do rounded eyes with the black acrylic paint. You can definitely draw these on first. I just went for it with the paint. And then I, again, did the same thing for the nose and the mouth. And then I took the black paint again and made really small lines upward on the eyes, just making little eyelashes. Did that on the two that I had painted the same. And then on the one with the circle eyes, just a few eyelashes on either side. And then put a couple dots of white paint in the center of those circles. Next, I took a piece of wire jute that I got from Dollar Tree and I just made it into like a circle and then pinch that circle closed in the center and added some hot glue to keep that closed in the center. And then once I had that shape, I kind of just held it in the center, pinched that, and then curved those ends upward. And then took some twine and hot glued that around the center where those were hot glued together and wrapped it around a bunch of times. And then I did make three sets of those. And then I took this pink and white fabric that I got from Walmart and I just cut little pieces of it, just big enough to be hot glued on either of those loops. So I needed six of those and then just put some hot glue around the jute and place down the fabric. After those were all glued on, I just went around with some detailing scissors and cut off the excess fabric. Next, I take the twine again and cut a little piece and make a tiny little bow. And I make three of those and hot glue each of them to the little ears. Last thing I do is hot glue each of those onto each of my little bunnies. That's it for this project. Thank you so much for watching.